Why did I bring you here? Not to answer questions. Aloy. Survival requires perfection. It was a test to hone my skills against a dangerous new machine. No. Follow. These are Nora hunting lands. They must be protected. If you hadn't destroyed the Sawtooth, how many braves might it have killed or injured tomorrow? The lesson lives within the question, Aloy. For years, you've trained to win the Proving, but only for yourself. As a brave, it will be your duty to fight for your tribe. My tribe? You said I wouldn't need them. But I never said the tribe wouldn't need you. The strength to stand alone, Aloy, is the strength to make a stand. To serve a purpose greater than yourself. That is the lesson you must learn. And remember it. After the proving. And after I'm gone. We're finished here. Follow. Dawn has passed. This will be your last day in the Embrace as an outcast. Use the time to set your mind on the challenges before you. When it is time for you to go to Mother's Heart, I'll be waiting for you along the way. I'll see you at Mother's Heart then. You will. Might regret this. speak so it's time are you ready yes i guess it's louder than i expected you've never been so close before i guess everything's bigger up close soon it'll all seem familiar like home i don't know about that look for high matriarch tirsa She'll help you. Any other concerns? I'm ready to do this. See you back home in a few days? 
You will not find me there, Aloy. Here. Take this, too. Remember. Why are you talking like we'll never see each other again? No. No! You should be with the tribe. And I will always be an outcast. But I told you, I have that figured out. I'll come to you in secret. I'll be the one breaking the law, not you. You don't even have to talk to me. This attachment to me will only hold you back. It's my wish that you embrace the tribe. You've lived in isolation long enough. Not until now, I didn't. For your sake, I must go where you will never find me. This... This is goodbye. I see. I'm... glad to have this then. It will... remind me of you. Of everything you did. And how you help prepare me for this day. Thank you. Heavier than it looks. But the cord is strong. May all mother bless you, Aloy. And you. How could he do this? Today of all days. I have to keep my mind on the proving. You will turn back, outcast. Or bleed. Your choice. Make way! Make way! Braves, stand aside. She is welcome here. Mother's heart is open to you, child. Come. I assure you, most Nora aren't so rude as those idiots. You're Tirsa? <laughs> Who else would I be? Come on now. I've been waiting for this day a long time. You have? Oh, yes. But for the moment, I must leave you. I have other outsiders to keep safe tonight. You what? Envoys from another tribe, the Karja, come to observe the proving, and oh, how the Nora hate the Karja. Karja? But that's my problem. We will talk later. In the meantime, enjoy the festival. Oh, down the path to the right, you'll find an old friend who can't wait to see you. But I don't know anyone here. <laughs> Try telling him that. We will talk later. May the goddess protect. What is going on? Aloy, isn't it? I'm remembering your name correctly? Are you the old friend Tirsa told me about? I don't know you. <laughs> I see you don't recognize me. Well, it was a long time ago. 
Teb is my name. You were half my size when you saved me from a herd of machines. I remember. You tried to thank me. I never forgot that day. All these years, I hoped to see you again, if you came to run in the Proving. As you can see, I didn't turn out to be much of a hunter. I served the tribe as a stitcher instead, a maker of garments and armor. In preparation for this day, I've made an outfit for you. I hope you like it. What's it going to cost? Cost? <laughs> Nothing. Consider the thanks I tried to give years ago. Long overdue. There. Try it on whenever you feel like it. Uh, th thank you, Teb. I've never had anything like this before. Well, it's yours. I think you'll find it affords more protection than what you were wearing. Every outfit offers some advantage. It's always a trade-off. Anyway, I shouldn't keep you any longer. Head for the Matriarch's Lodge if you want to find Tirsa. You'll know it when you see it. A large wooden building with an angry mob waiting outside. Tirsa said something about envoys from another tribe? Yes, that's what the mob's angry about. Karja visiting our sacred land for the first time in years. I'd expect to see some tomatoes fly, maybe rocks. Hopefully not spears. In any case, be ready to duck. You think the Karja wanna make peace? Ah. Red rays will come again, you wait see. You're drunk. Why do you have to go climbing houses? Oh, not supposed to go climbing on other people's roofs, huh? What an idiot he is. Every year this happens, every year. At least he's not trying to Listen run a break trail. Listen carefully now, for you'll have to tell this when I'm gone. The show's supposed to make you feel you alive, begin. not like you'd rather oh, be my. working. Okay, I'm no, just a proving itself. People, machines, and beasts. All were her children. They lived alongside each other in the comfort of her wild embrace. Like some other protection. Listen carefully now, for you'll have to tell this when I'm gone. Aloy, over here. Karst? What are you doing here? Careful. Pretend like we've never met. I wasn't supposed to trade with outcasts in the wilds, remember? How could I forget? And how generous of you to talk to me now. Don't be like that. You know I'll be rooting for you in the Proving tomorrow. Can't wait to see the looks on some of these faces when you win. And if you need any last-minute supplies, uh, I'm your man. All sales are...
always happy to take. I've come to make amends. I won't deny them the chance. In a moment, we shall bless the proving. But first, we have guests to welcome. For two years, we have been at peace with Akarja. It is time to restore our bonds of trade with Meridian. These envoys come to us under a banner of peace. Peace. It's peace. <clears throat> An annunciation of gratitude written Killers by and the slavers. hand of yeah. Sun King yeah. of Killers Arles. and Slavers! Uh, hey, hey! Luminance of Hold the... your fruit, nor... Uh, uh. nor a faithful. Hold your fruit. Now, I'm Azaram, not Karja. So I'll put it to you straight. The 13th Sun King was a murderous bung. Oh, he was. He was a tyrant and a monster. He raided my tribe for blood sacrifice, just like yours. My own sister was taken. I hated the Karja. But the 13th King is dead. Two years now. And who killed him? The 14th. Yeah. Not because for power, but because someone had to put an end to his father's atrocities. Yeah! yeah. The message that this poor priest means to read is an apology. Straight from the lips of the 14th King. So please, can't you lend him your ears? Thank you. <clears throat> an enunciation of gratitude written by the hand of Sun King Avad, 14th luminance of the Radiant Line. <clears throat> People of Kedora, old man. On the eve of your proving, all their worthless No, the Karja stand with you. As the sun's light frames the stoutest trees, as those you have nurtured take their places among your braves. Unknown device detected. What's that mean? You're the only other person I've ever seen wearing a focus. Where did you get yours? What? Anora. Wearing one of these? That's impossible. Your tribe fears the old places, forbids them. <laughs> Who says I'm like other Nora? Why, well, yeah. <laughs> I guess you're not. If you've gone delving in the ruins of the metal world. Ah! <clears throat> What's wrong? Apologies. Ah, uh, malfunction. Oh, Lynn? You making friends with locals, are we? I'll... I'll come back. We'll talk later. Have to go. Whoa. Well, I guess he's more hungover than I thought. <laughs> hey. You got the same trinket that Olin has on his head. Since when did those become fashionable? His name is Olin? Who is he? And where did he get one of these? Ah, he's just a scrounger with friends in high places. Now, he spends half his time digging for artifacts, the other half drinking or dicing. As for the trinket, well, I guess he dug it up somewhere. Just a weird old jewel he sticks on his face. I mean, no offense. It looks great on you. I've never seen armor like... You've never seen Vanguard's... It has to be. The Vanguard of the Sun King's best. Life takers and machine breakers to a one. It might even give a Nora war maid like you more trouble than she can handle. <laughs> With all that metal to slow you down? I doubt it. Yeah, hard to say, from where I... I should make my way... Yeah, look, maybe I shouldn't say this, but... it's I mean, you're smart, you're obviously capable, and... Well, I mean, look at you. Uh, what are you talking about? You know what. All right, if you ever visit Meridian, look me up. I'll show you around, make introductions. It'd be a whole new life, if you want it. I'll even introduce you to my sister. She's got more connections than I do. I thought you said she was captured and killed by the last Sun King. Ha! <laughs> captured, yes. Killed, no. It takes more than a few cards to finish Ursa. She got away. Now she's captain of the entire Vanguard. That's quite a story. Maybe I'll tell it to you sometime over a drink. 
Anyway, I have to go to that blessing thing, too. So, uh, see you around, maybe? We shouldn't let those Karja outsiders pollute our sacred land. We'll start the blessing when all aspirants are in place. Aloy, take your place right there. The prayer lantern is yours. I made it for you. Pah, blasphemy. Sisters. Aspirants, before each of you sits a crafted by your mother. In her honor, light its flame. In honor of Rost, and all he did to help me get here. All mother, hear our prayer! What is the child but a mother's hope that takes flight? A glowing flame that climbs the air, set free to the wind, sailing the sky till it fades and falls. So, from one to another, Passes the chain of love. There's Olin. I have some questions for him. Hello, Olin. You know my name. Why did you act so str- Must be this festival. Stop dodging my- All right. I've never seen any- In a ruin. Steel jo I found my focus. If you've dealt just- What are you doing here? Aaron needed a- When all this- So you're an explorer? Just another out- When we spoke earlier- It didn't show me any- You're not a very convincing- Do you always accuse people- Only the ones who aren't telling the- Fire and spit, girl! I'm a plain hammered man with nothing to hide. You don't believe me? That's your trouble. Stand. <sighs> I'm used to being shunned by the tribe. It's nothing personal. You should... Find your bed, outcast, and dream of winning the Proving. That's the closest you're gonna get. Oh, this is the bed house? With you standing guard? I figured it was the latrine. Your... your very presence here... <sighs> well, what? Look who's come in from the wild, the motherless outcast. <laughs> I see you've still got a scar from where that rock I threw hit you. Now that's a cherished memory. You can be a real lard sometimes, boss. Cut it out. Aw, you even try- So this is how it's gonna be- This is how it's gonna be- You belong in the- 